Hello, everyone, and welcome back to a brand new Lush Life video. I'm your host, Leon, joined here by the illustrious Mrs. Lush. Today, we're doing one of our favorite, we're performing one of our favorite pastimes, which is just basking in the glory that is the ubiquitous stupidity on the internet. Fortunately, there's places that curate these things for us so we can kind of just browse through and feel better about our lives collectively here and with you watching at home because there are just some people out there that <laughs> So jumping right into the face palms here. Don't mind the delaying us from takeoff. We ain't trying to take off or anything. Just gotta make sure you get that. <sighs> How hard would you cringe if you were on that flight? Uh, I'm, I'm secondhand dying right now just from watching it by if proxy. If you're another passenger, by proxy. Can you say something? I mean, look at everybody on the flight, like. They're all just kind of like staring at the in. camera. Oh, no, now he's awake. Okay. Flight attendant, can you take your seat now? I don't know if they're just adding those subtitles, if there is actually audio of them saying that in the back, like they're trying to take, ah, dude, I'm just like, I'm shivering with cringe right now. It hurts so bad. Like, we're so fucked. Like this, the, the audacity, the egocentricness, yeah. the lack in zero uh, consideration for anybody other than yourself is a disease. Oh man, resisting arrest in America. Why did it shoot for, why did it shoot for a defect? Jesus Christ, why, why, why the fuck, off camera, why the fuck does this only happen on Reddit every single time it restarts the video three times? What the, is it a fucking Chrome setting? Is it, is it cause I'm screen recording? Is it cause, my fucking sphincter itches perpetually every single day of my life. I don't know why. That's Sorry. That's not for off camera. Off, that, no, that's a, that's all. That, no, that's that's a that is an off camera rant. No, he's dead <laughs> I did issue it for a defective equipment. It's eighty dollars. Uh, you have till September sixteenth to take care of this. Oklahoma. Uh, get you to sign there. What? Eighty bucks, probably so like a, a broken headlight or something. You've been driving around for six months like that. I'm truthful. Well, I'm not gonna give you a warning for something you've been driving for six months. She probably already got a warning. Is that how he knows it's been six months? You don't want to sign it? No, because I don't think that I deserve to pay $80 for something that is fixable and I can fix it. All right. That's all you want Go ahead, to step out of First of all, <laughs> I don't think that I deserve to right. deal with the consequences of my actions. Correct. Classic, classic America. <laughs> Just classic human being, really, in general. Why? Because you're under arrest. Step out. $80 to Step felony in three, two, one. This is a little bit long, so we'll skim through it, but. Step out, I'm giving you a lock. Oh no, Step she's out. putting up the window. Is she gonna drive Lock in her. Oh, snap. Drops the pad. You be fair with me and I'll be fair with you. Step out. No. You're under arrest. What does that even I'm mean? Not. Oh, no, I'm not. Step you out. You are full of because you're not taking me under no arrest. I do not, do not oh, take shut off. shut up and give me that. Step out. No. No, we're beyond that. Oh, oh we're beyond right. that. Excuse me, that's some toddler behavior right Too there. Late. Oh, okay, you went from not wanting to take the time out to taking the real full on punished for a week. Oh no, I'll go to time out now. Okay, okay. I'll yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, now that I'm under arrest, I'll yeah. sign it and pay the eighty dollars. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm, imagine how that works. Nope. She just tried to did she just drive? Yes, yeah, she did. She did? What a psychopath. Hold on. This is gonna get better. I kinda actually wanna watch it. No, we don't. No, no, the guns no, are no, drawn. No, no, no. Get out of the car. Get out of the Calling car. Calling for backup. Get out of the car. Get out Wait, of I'm not. That could be a taser gun, actually. No, that looks no. like the pistol, get but the that was mainly just to get her out of the car, I suppose. Get out of the car. You better leave me. Oh my God. Here we go. Get down. Oh. This is unbelievable. Fire. Yeah. Your hands behind your back. Over an $80 citation, bro. Like, it's just, I mean, this is what you get for being an entitled rat. I'm sorry. I don't feel bad at all. Like, whatever. Yeah. I don't feel bad for her. No. I said leave. Do you have any? Oh, tasers out. No, no. Oh, you didn't zap. Put your hands behind your back. We have a wonton suspect in custody. Lay down and put your hands behind your back. Now. Oh my God, this is amazing. No, you will Did you have not. any respect for authority whatsoever? No. You fucked up. Could have just signed the paper an hour ago. This is 
Oh, the hinge, the hinge cuffs are the worst, dude. Those things hurt like a bastard. Did you realize you just got yourself yeah, you've been, a whole lot? I've been in hinge cuffs before. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Do tell. Absolutely. What hurts? Everything. I... I got ambulance on the way. Check you out. Ambulance? I don't need an ambulance. <laughs> well, you got taste. So I feel like she. Wait. You. you did not have to taser me. You oh, no, I, she's like, I don't need an aid. It's like she's having a coming to God moment. A little clarity sweeping over her now of how much of an idiot she is. You have to taser me. You, you wouldn't didn't. comply. You wouldn't get out. And then you tried to kick me. So Why? yes, I did. Yeah, I tried to kick you because yeah. I'm a country girl. Because no, I and didn't. You got like taste because. <laughs> After all that, you, you want officer, you got me. I did try to kick you. I'm a bit of a country girl, born and raised in Oklahoma, Chot Town. Mother, father, pray Jesus, rest in peace, heaven and that's what I get the little fire god of me. I come out there, I go, who's who, sweet, kick the butt. You tell me, oh, $80 ticket. You know, I never know what's going to happen, officer. I swear to God. <laughs> oh, Lord bless it. I apologize. This is unbelievable. What? This video. I know. It's crazy, right? What did I tell you? Basking? We're basking right now. Bask in it. Smell it. Sniff it. No, I, I wish. I would be doing the same thing. <laughs> yes, but I you just, would. yeah, basking in the stupidity that, that permeates. Familiar <laughs> yeah, the sight. scoop, the scoop, the soup. I do it for online stupidity as well. Pro Trump candidate suggests taking all the boats out of the water to lower sea levels. I'm um, not, not sure, sure that's, that's how it works. <laughs> I, I don't know if that's how it works. I'm no geologist, oceanologist. Or archaeologist. <laughs> but I'm not sure that's how it works. Are you a meteorologist? Yes, that I am. Okay. So uh, while being naked from the waist down, I made eye contact with my boyfriend and lifted my leg to fly. No! <laughs> I pushed a little too hard and just pissed on the floor. No! Like it's like, oh my God, this is what man. Relatable. Actually, that's kind of funny, dude. That's actually, that's a good one. <laughs> Pushed a little too hard. At least you didn't boop. I like the intent, like just naked waist down, going for that ripper. No bladder control. Yeah, that's like a comfort level that a lot of couples aspire to have, I think, <laughs> you know? Absolutely. Did you hear that Megan Trainer and her husband? Yeah, they shit next to each other. They got like side by side toilets. I love that. Imagine just like that could totally be me. And imagine you. just like right here, just on the thrones, just scrolling Twitter together, just hit, hitting hitting the heavy grunters, just oh! like I normally sound like in the morning when I'm getting my post coffee grunter out. I'd love to have you by my side for that. No thanks. <laughs> and the next room is. Yeah, and then, and then we don't have dual toilets now, but you could just stand and piss on the floor next to me while I'm doing that. Like All this woman here. All I have to do is here. sneeze and I piss on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> when your clickbait gets called out, there's no better way to get in shape than to prepare for a triathlon. This guy will tell you. I'm that guy, and no, I won't tell you that. <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Yeah, I would have to imagine most people don't need to do what it takes to prepare for a triathlon to take their first steps in getting into shape. How about just little- just walk a couple laps yeah, around your neighborhood. Yeah, a couple laps around the neighborhood, one less soda a day. Let's start there. <laughs> Guy with suspended license shows up to Zoom court while driving. You okay? Are you, are you driving right now? Yeah. You're suspended and you're in court. First of all, interrupting the court. I'm not even driving. I'm parking somebody's car because they couldn't park. That's all I was doing. <laughs> that is driving. My man, my man joined a Zoom court date on his cell phone in a car while he's, while he's in court for being suspended license. Oh, Lord help me. All right, I'm going to need you to park your car and get out of the car, okay? If you're having a bad day, just say that. Oh, I'm not having a bad day. day until oh, you start talking oh, while oh. driving. He better watch at it. At the same time that you're suspended. This guy right here just can't believe it. <laughs> He's like, what am I watching right now? But the worst thing to do is to tell her, what, are you having a bad day? <laughs> yeah, oh, oh, I'm sorry. So That's going to make oh, I'm sorry. I had defensive. To, I had to do a little down the street lap in my car to get to the courthouse. What do you want me to do? I don't even know where to begin. I know where. For starters, the angles and wobbly behavior from his phone means he was completely late. It also proves he's driving. Second, Tyler laughing is just perfect. Bro, That is that is too much. I'm sorry, but... No more mass mandates. This is America, home of the free because of the brave. I don't care about anything other than the idea that this woman thought this was a good idea. <laughs> like, <laughs> there you like, go. Your fucking patriotic hat, Trump, Biden. I don't give a shit about all that. But like, what makes you think this doesn't make you look like a complete tool? 
she starts singing the lyrics too. Oh boy, and now her son's gonna be terrorized. Yeah. On the internet, I'm sure. Like her, like I don't know where they're from. I can take a guess. <laughs> Cringetopia. That would be a would be an appropriate subreddit as well. Uh, this second comment. That kid's friends' classmates are going to make fun of him so hard for so this. So bad. Oh my god. Imagine going into school with all your friends just pulling up your mom's TikTok account. Like, bro, what is, what are you doing? How did she convince you to do this with her? With his handmade keychains that go for five dollars each, this eight-year-old boy raised four thousand to erase the lunch debt of students from his school and six others. Eight-year-old does months of manual labor so his friends who are children can afford to eat without going into debt. <laughs> I'm sorry, the lunch debt is that a thing at school now? They're offering debt for students to get lunch. Maybe, maybe they, they have like a little. I'm, sh I'm sure it's digitized. Of course, when we were growing up, we still used like quarters, cash. quarters and cash to pay for things, which... You didn't go to school, but okay. Uh, seventh grade, thank you very much. <laughs> and junior and senior year. I've told this story. I was homeschooled most of my life, but I did go to public school for my last two years of high school. I was a captain of the football team, dated a cheerleader. Yeah, yeah, I was yeah, the shit, yeah, okay? Yeah. My glory days yeah. ended in 2003. <laughs> and now I'm a, an old crusty boomer with more white hair showing up in my beard every single day. You should see your chest. Because I'm married to you. Yeah, don't even show my <laughs> chest hairs. It's bad news. Uh, yeah, I don't mind eight months doing, I don't mind eight-year-olds doing months of manual labor. How else are we supposed to enjoy our iPhones? <laughs> got him! Oh, gosh. got him! Get those fucking, Wait, get those know. child labor camps firing in China. Book. Sorry, buddy, it's not, oh, a AOC. Sorry, buddy, it's not oh. Christmas yet. Wishing all our loved ones, neighbors, and friends across the country lighting their first candle tonight, a beautiful and happy Hanukkah. I don't know why that made me laugh. <laughs> what, this guy? No, because it says it's not, sorry, buddy, it's not Christmas yet, <laughs> is the thing. <laughs> oh, nice. So Aww. this is just a classic, like... Hanukkah was before Christmas no, last this is, year? No, this is literally the classic meme. God, what is the Twitter meme where it's like... Someone says, oh man, I love grape. There's a meme online, it's very popular. It literally embodies Twitter. And it's like someone that tweets, oh man, I love grapefruits. And then someone in the replies with like a mad face, like, oh, what does that mean? You hate bananas? Why don't you go? Like, you yeah. can't say yeah. something nice on Twitter yeah. without this moron in the comments. Like all she's doing is wishing someone happy Hanukkah. That's all that tweet was. And this guy had to come up and be like, what's wrong with saying Merry Christmas? No, I'm taking it a totally different way. I think it was just a joke. So this person saying, sorry, buddy, it's not Christmas yet. Like, just no. This guy's how, like, a joke, Christmas but this guy is this guy's not joking. Hanukkah, typically. This guy in the com in the replies is that contrarian that has oh, to. Oh yeah, yeah. That he's the contrarian he's the that has. To, yeah, the banana guy that has to take every Sorry. single tweet that does that and 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 paraphrase what it's supposed to mean and get mad about what they didn't say. That guy's a dumb fuck. Twitter sucks. Twitter's <laughs> awesome, but it sucks. Internet is awesome, but it sucks. Life is awesome. And it sucks. That is Let's very keep true. going. The universe is awesome, but it also sucks. actually there's okay. nothing that sucks about the universe. It's all really cool and expansive and very hard to comprehend, quite frankly. If you ever think, here we it's go. Happening. Ready? Tangent. If you ever oh think about how small we are in the grand expanse of the universe, not even just to what we know, billions of galaxies, billions of endless voids and everywhere, and we're just this little insignificant race of morons gallivanting around this floating rock in the middle of endless expansiveness. Oh, my phone just told me to breathe. I mean, my watch. And we think our problems matter? Imagine hating England. There is no country in the world more beautiful. I feel like when people say, I hate England, they're not referring to the plants and cows. But that being said, I would love to do. That's very scenic. Uh, I've so been beautiful. to England briefly. You for, did for a conference. What? You, you, you. Oh yeah. Wow, we were married. Uh, maybe you remember it was two and a half years ago when I went. Uh, but it was like I went to the UK for five days for Insomnia, the, like the video game conference over in the London area. Uh, but I would love to do like a historical countryside tour, like a two week, you know, like a boomer tour of England to see some places like this. Stop in like little hole in the wall pubs, get hammered on Guinness with the locals. And Guinness? maybe fuck a sheep if there's a good looking one outside the bar. I don't know. Guinness, are you going to? Yeah, Ireland, whatever. I'm sorry, not Guinness. I think maybe Ireland is the place I want to go more than Denon. England. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, I heard the food in Ireland is terrible. Absolute yeah. shit. Coming from I know who, but. What, you know who? Yeah, your mother-in-law. My mother-in-law is your mom. <laughs> Huh? What's happening? Wait. My mother-in-law is your mother. You just said No, you're, oh shit. Wait, my mother-in-law, your mother, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> ah! 
No! My desk! It's moving everywhere! How many Guinness Son of a you bitch! Had I'm hammered right now. It's 12 o'clock at night during oh the day. Oh my gosh. Yeah, anyways. I just want to anyway, go for, I just want to go for the beautiful side. I just want to go on vacation. Yeah. Just shut up. I don't care where. <laughs> a reason why YouTube ads are a problem. First of all, if you're watching this, they're not a problem. Q ad roll. Hey YouTube, maybe don't put ads before first aid vids. I don't have time to watch Red Lobster out of my grandma's choking out of his phone. <laughs> Learn the Heimlich first so you don't have to look up a YouTube video when it's right, happening. Right, take a basic CPR first yeah. aid course. Like you could, if you'd watched any movie in the 90s probably, you could just, just grab them and pick. What's the grip, this still? Is this the grip? That works. This one? I mean, or you can do fit hand over fist. Hand over fist like this? I was always told this one and then like the hard really? thumb area to get into the, right into the diaphragm. Well, yeah. It's supposed to be like right under the solar plexus, right? Want me to push on where it's, it's supposed to It's the part, the, the thing that knocks <gasps> the wind out yes. you, right? Yeah. Oh. What's going on with <clears throat> this? Sorry. Your watch is acting a fool right now. It's having right a problem. Now. Yeah, you need to throw that thing in the bin. I don't know, it just told me I ran a marathon, so that sounds cool. <laughs> it, uh, how many? Two, How many three. minutes are in a kilometer? Um, is it like 87? 87, close, yeah. down a little bit. 63? 85. 85? 85 is correct! High five, hell yes! Woo! Who was the first this has person to, be fake, to land right? on the sun? Lance something, Lance. Lance, Lance Armstrong <laughs> is yeah. correct. Oh Pretty hot, heaven. the sun, right? To land on. You know, his steroids that he took, they allowed him to withstand the heat of the sun. <laughs> what country is Venice, Italy located in for $100? Do you have any clue? Gosh, I'm going to be a teacher, so I should know this. You um, probably should. What Don't country admit is, that! What country is Venice, Italy located in? Oh, God. Paris? No! Come on! This, in Paris. I refuse to believe this is real. People I refuse. Can't, I also refuse now. Now. I mean, the, it is TikTok, so there is a... It, Minimum 50% chance it's fake. But also... People are dumb. People are remarkably dumb, yeah. All right, that's about all the face palms I can take. Is that it? Listen, we feel energized and our spirits are lifted because we got our daily dose of ubiquitous stupidity on the internet, and we're so glad to have shared that treat with you guys uh, there at home. We love you, as always. Mm -hmm. We appreciate you for watching along with us, and we can't wait to see you in the very next video. Deuces. Ah. Oh. You wanted me to blow a kiss?